Hi, my name is Nick Cha Kim, and I'm the founder and president of Gallery Row in downtown Los Angeles. I've got a wonderful story to tell you. And for me, it all begins in downtown. Back before the millennium, downtown Los Angeles was not the vibrant city you see today. There were hundreds of empty storefronts and the streets filled at night with homeless, drug addicts, hookers, and runaways. And then there was me. My friend and I had this great idea. What if instead of Skid Row, downtown had a gallery row? And instead of all these empty storefronts, what if they were filled with creative businesses? And what if there was public art everywhere? And that's exactly what we set out to do. We wrote a proposal, joined our neighborhood council, lobbied our local politicians, and it worked. On May 15th, 2004, Gallery Row was born with just three galleries. Now in 2012, there are over 50 art galleries, museums, theaters, and public art installations, and over 50,000 people regularly attend the monthly downtown art walk. Despite all odds, art and culture changed the very perception of the most derelict corner in Los Angeles. My name's Tom Gilmore. I'm a developer here in downtown Los Angeles. We're in the Old Bank District, uh, an area I developed back in the late 1990s. The Old Bank District and Gallery Row are, are fascinating because one of the things we knew that was going to be essential in the growth and stability of the Old Bank District was our relationship to the arts. And it turned out that there were a wacky group of people, and you happen to be one of them, <laughs> who, who were essentially artists who were looking to designate an area specific for artists within the downtown, the new downtown community. It was people like you and, and the other folks within Gallery Row who began to work separately from me and my work in the Old Bank District to create this arts-focused corridor within downtown. And I supported it right away only because I understood how extraordinarily important it was to link parts of downtown with this Gallery Row. Art Walk and everything that started all comes from the Old Bank District and Gallery Row and their initial efforts here because prior to Gallery Row and prior to the Old Bank District, there was nothing here. Absolutely nothing. These were all vacant buildings. And it's not just happening here. More than 90 cities in America have designated similar cultural districts placing arts at the very center of their urban revitalization efforts. And there are hundreds all over the world. They're not just a meeting ground for artists and art enthusiasts, but often serve as ground zero for political protests and grassroots organizations. Gallery districts activate challenged communities, attract residents and tourists, enhance property values, boost employment, and contribute to a progressive and innovative environment. My name's Alex Schaefer. I've been part of the downtown Gallery Row action for about eight years. I spend most of my time painting down here. I remember downtown, I mean, first moving to LA to go to college. Driving up Maine in 1987 was like Mad Max meets like a zombie movie. It was ridiculous how undeveloped and just sort of like wild it had, be, it had become in parts of downtown. Downtown appeals to me because I, I love painting urban landscapes. I, I love the vibrant environment that has happened to grow down here. I love uh, Broadway, spring between you know City Hall and Ninth. So I guess it's the old financial district. <laughs> and then the irony is I'm painting all these banks on fire. <laughs> it's artists moving in. It's city rezoning so that that artists can live in, you know, what used to be industrial spaces. And then the community that starts to grow around that, I think it kind of revitalizes the neighborhood. Please follow me as I explore art walks and gallery districts all around the world. I'll speak with famous artists and curators as I go off to discover unknown artists in their very own communities. Let's examine the development of creative districts as a strategy for urban revitalization and speak with cultural leaders, business owners, politicians, and property developers and find out how these districts came to be and reflect on each destination's unique strengths, cultural heritage, and artistic contribution to the world we live in today. My name is Nick Cha Kim and I art walk around the world. That's all I remember, it's about me. <laughs> and what he did with Gallery Row. God love him. Yeah. Wow. All right, thanks buddy. Awesome. <laughs>